by the end of this video you will be able to integrate constant integrate linear functions and integrate linear functions with powers let's start with the integration of constant and the integral power rule will help in most of the solutions let's integrate this function this integral notation is a symbolic instruction to integrate to with respect to x this dx is also a symbolic instruction this will help us to integrate this to it is something as 2x to the power of 0 x to the power of 0 is equal to 1 2 multiply x to the power of 0 it is something as 2 times 1 and it is something as 2 next we are going to integrate we are going to add 1 to the power and we are going to bring down everything 0 plus 1 at the power of x will equally come down and we're going to add our plus c which is a constant 0 plus 1 is 1 which is 2x to the power of 1 and this 0 plus 1 is equal to 1 at the denominator and our answer will become 2x plus c to keep it simple whenever you need to integrate a constant return the constant and respect x and here we are going to multiply x to it then plus c and from the options our answer is C. Next, let's integrate this function. I can rewrite this by taking this minus out of the integral. And our answer is minus 2x plus C. This C was discarded in differentiation our answer is a next let's consider this function let's rewrite this question to become this both are the same i'm integrating with respect to x hence i'm going to add increment to this x 3a is just a constant. Next, we are going to integrate this by applying this formula. I will add 1 to the power and I will still bring it down. Hence, I'm going to add 1 here and I will return everything to the denominator. And you add plus c. And your answer is 3ax plus c and from the options our answer is b next let's integrate this constant this is a constant and i can rewrite this instead of this if this where should be dy then we are going to have this then i will add increment to y still using this formula next we are going to integrate and our answer is minus pi x plus c divided by one we can let the one out and this is our answer our answer is c next 
let's integrate this function we are integrating this constant with respect to p next instead of this i will rewrite this for the integration because it's dp i'm going to add increment to p and no longer x next we're going to integrate this applying this formula next we're going to add increment to the p and also bring it down to the denominator next we now add the constant and this is our answer our answer is c in conclusion whenever you integrate a constant you return that constant add x to it and plus c next let's consider the integration of linear functions let's integrate this function to integrate this indefinite function we are going to use this formula this is 3 to the power of 1 while this is 4x to the power of 0 and this is our answer and our answer is b next we are going to integrate this function this is our answer from the options our answer is a next let's consider the integration of linear functions with powers let's integrate this function the first step is that we're going to apply law of indices to this function that is this x squared at the denominator we now move up to become x to the power of minus 2 remember one of these law of indices next let's integrate using the integral power rule to integrate we are going to add plus 1 to the minus 2 and we are going to bring everything down to the denominator and this is our answer we can equally rewrite it like this both are the same our answer is c let's integrate this function here the first step is this x we take away one of this x and we're going to have one divide three to the power of three next we're going to apply law of indices next we're going to integrate using the power rule next we're going to add our increment and this becomes our final result from the options our answer is a subsequently there is an exception to this rule where we cannot apply the law of indices that is in integration this does not exist because if you try to apply the power rule the integration will cease to exist to make sure that this does not happen the integration of 1 over x is among one of the integrands with constant solution whenever you integrate 1 over x your answer is the natural log of x plus c from the options our answer is d and always remember that ln simply means natural logarithm likewise the natural log of x is equal to log x of base e
check out these suggested integration videos. This is Calculus. In the next video, we are going to consider the integration of quadratic and polynomial functions. To locate all the videos, follow the link on the screen. I will see you in the next video.